Oh my god, I didn't go off going to Hawthorne. I mean, not Hawthorne Lombard. Fuck. Because I would have missed this. Mustang, too. Ooh, a strange badging on it. Electric. Son of a bitch. With an electric motor. That's probably why it's popped up in the front. Because they have a lightweight electric motor. And then a fucking hugely heavy thing in the back. I believe it's. I think this is one of the older ones. I think this is a 74. Not sure. And it's for sale. And what does it say? Custom 100% electric 1976. $9,000. Uh, I don't think so. Electric. Hence they have to put the heavy duty springs in the back. No, that's a bummer. They shouldn't have made it electric. That was a mistake. Oh well. People can do stupid stuff to their cars. This is America. And I see they don't have a back seat because that's where the box. <coughs> a box made out of wood. I would say that wouldn't be a good idea to make wooden box for your flammable batteries. But here I'm being a critic. It's pretty though. Um, like the metallic green. This almost reminds me of my mother's car. She had a darker green. Um, her 65 Mustang. Bought in 1976. I actually think I would like one of these. They basically it's a pinna with different um, different body work, but what can I say? I like it, and you could have put a V8 in it. So 